question is when all believe in one god why people fight in the name of god and in the name of religion the person has a question that if all the people all the human beings or most of them believe in one god believe in one type of religion why do they fight why is there so much of infighting riots etc no religion which i know of tell that people should fight with each other unnecessarily no religion says that neither the quran neither the veda neither the bible unnecessarily should not and the holy quran says in surah maida chapter number 5 verse number 32 if anyone kills any human being unless it be for murder or creating mischief in the land it is as though you have killed the whole of humanity quran does not say if you kill a muslim you have killed the whole of humanity if you kill any human being unless it be for murder or creating mischief in the land it is as though you have killed the whole of humanity so no religion teaches that people should fight with each other unnecessarily suppose people are trying to oppress you then most of the religion says that you should put that oppressor back in its place quran says that surah anfal surah tauba that if the people try to drive you out of your house out of your faith out of your land then you can fight them for self defense even the gita the whole bhagavad gita it is known as the nectar of the vedas lord krishna he is giving advice to arjun that see you fight for the truth even if the opposite people are relatives don't stop if they are in the wrong you fight the quran says in surah isra chapter 17 verse 81 waqul jal haq wa zaq al batil in al batil qana zahuka unzul min al quran ma huwa shifa wa rahmatul mu'minin wala is zalm in la khasara that when truth is heard against falsehood falsehood perishes for falsehood is by its nature bound to perish the quran is a healing and mercy for those who believe it was revealed in stages but for those who are unbelievers it's nothing but loss after loss so basically no religion tells you to fight unless in self defense even the police kills the robber in self defense kills the criminal but normally under normal circumstances people should not fight but yet i do know that people fight why is the big question you know what the reason the reason is people fight for power for material things the politician he wants vote so what does he do he instigates a riot a riot and then you get marginalized and then hindus vote hindu muslim vote muslim politicians if a builder wants a land you can't acquire the land because there are thousand huts there what does he do he instigates a riot on the base of religion the huts are burned down and then he builds a big building on that land for money so these people for power for money for material requirements these people they instigate the riots otherwise the common hindu the common muslim alhamdulillah we love each other we love our non muslim brother <laughs> bombay if you know bombay even during partition there was not such a right as we had a couple of years ago were engineered by whom politicians politicians engineered it all because for power for material desire otherwise no religion says that you should fight with one another we do know we have similarities we agree with that we have differences also but a politician on front of everyone you say ram bhi khuda allah bhi khuda front of it and behind he goes an engineers rats see we don't believe in pseudo secularism if suppose two people are there one person is saying 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 the other person is saying 2 plus 2 is equal to 5 that does not mean oh he's such a good man 2 plus 2 is also equal to 4 2 plus 2 is also equal to 5 i am a very deshbhakt secular person what secular hypocrisy i should have the guts to say see what you are saying 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 is right what you are saying 2 plus 2 is 5 is wrong but i will not fight with you i will tell you the truth i will not fight with you same the quran says in surah kafirun chapter 109 verse number 1 to 6 قل يا ايها الكافرون لا اعبد ما تعبدون ولا انتم عابدون ما اعبد ولا انا عابد ما عبدتم ولا انتم عابدون ما اعبد لكم دينكم ولي الدين say to those who reject faith i will not worship what you worship nor will you worship what i worship i will not be worshiping that which you want me to worship nor will you worship what i worship to you is your way to me is mine to your is your religion to me is mine i will present the truth to him why don't do idol worship don't have wrong concept of god yet if you have lakum dinukum waliyad din 
to use your way to me is mine. The Holy Quran says in Surah Baqarah chapter 2 verse number 256, like Allah there is no compulsion in religion. Truth stands out clear from error. If you hold the hand of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he will take you from darkness to light. If you hold the hand of the evil one, the devil, he will take you from light to darkness. The choice is yours. But no religion says that you should fight with each other unnecessarily. Hope that answers the question.